We're gonna keep going. Fuck it. Wait, did I talk to her? I don't want to go back. Ugh, fucking sideways. Okay. Uh. Hi. That's where all the extra spiders that were chasing me came from. Please die in a fire or something. Okay. And now the spellcasters. And all of that bullshit. Well, those I can deal with, because... So long as I have my torch, the spiders won't bother me, but... Yeah, figures. Alright, fine. Would you come over here, please? don't have any arrows left at all. Fine, I'll put the torch away. Come on. Come on. How many more? There's that one over there. Doesn't seem to be coming my way. If you, I require you. The nature of an item is greatly influenced by the soul that was used to create it. They can be tricky to use, but when wielded properly, are extremely powerful. This is what I meant by unique. These wares are not for use by. What? It's hard to believe now. But this land was once a flourishing kingdom. Its king, Vendrick, came close to unlocking the essence of the soul. What a dazzling soul he truly had. Imagine what I might create with such a powerful soul. Well, hints for the future there. It is said that our technique originates from a strange being that inhabited this land. <laughs> A pale beast that lived long, long ago. A we pale beast, huh? What exactly it was. If you find me, do you find me strange? <laughs> you humans are always this way. The way you glare at any unfamiliar creature. The mix of curiosity, fear, and revulsion. No, oh, it hardly concerns me. The nature of a thing. It's... Okay, that's about all she has to say. Oh, piss off. Bye. Right. Good lord! Da -da -da -da. Okay, so... Well, there's only really the gutter left, isn't there? I mean, I can't put it off anymore, can I? Oh, wait, yes I can! Yes I can! Because we haven't explored fully in the army camp. I can put it off! I can still put it off! I didn't go this way yet. 
So that means I don't have to... Nah. That didn't do anything. Hello. Visions of danger zone. Be wary, try beanpole? Be wary of beanpole. Why? What am I wary of here? There's a bunch of soldiers here. Come on. What the hell was that run cycle? Oh, shut the front door. That's a parry. That's a parrying stance, I swear to God. Ah, oh, the range! The range was Garbo! Try Scorpion Man, but friend ahead. Oh, hey, are those bigger versions of the little pigs in Majula? Okay, let's just get away from the archer. Smooth and silky stone. I could go trade a little bit with the crows. That's an option. Ah! Ran right into that one. Fuck off! What the hell is that run cycle? Like, what even is that? That's unfinished. That's just straight up unfinished. Nothing in the tents, really? Ah, oh, but I had intended to raid them. For supplies and stuff. I should get some more arrows or uh, bolts for my thing. Right, so that's the other direction. That's down with all the peasants and the stuff that leads to Brightstone something something. Ugh, the range on that second swing is ass. Is there anything else here? hearing something. Ah, 
Ah. There's a thing in there. How do I get in there? Well, I can't. There's a... Yeah, I hear you. Enemy ahead, therefore sniper spot? The treasure chest in there. Be wary of trap. Do I jump down the well? Better not die from this. Ah. Someone jumped down the well anyway. I see a blood stain. Damn it. Aha! I guess one of the pigs fell down here. Hey, green blossom. Nice. And that leads up. I see. Yeah! No! 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 Oh my! Oh, you! 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 Oh! You piece of shit motherfucking ass garbage! God damn you all to hell! The whole game! Not a hint of mimics! There's no mimics anywhere. Everything's cool. All the treasure chests are nice. Nothing happens. Oh. <laughs> FromSoft, you bastards. I will cheese you to death. I think I have some arrows, actually. But I don't have a bow I can use. Ah, damn it. Which means I have to go to the bonfire, which means I'm gonna have to respawn all the enemies, which means the mimic is gonna go back into treasure chest form. Can I use that one? Can't tell, because I can't see how much I need to use it. No. Oh, my fucking god. Okay, shouldn't use all my arrows on these assholes. Seriously, what is that walk cycle? Who did that? Honestly, who did that? Like, honestly. How the hell was he defending with his shield there?
Like, he's going sideways! He's not even going straight towards me, he's like... He's like shuffling vaguely sideways at me. Seriously, how the hell is he protecting himself with his shield when he does that? Okay. Alright. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You guys are not really difficult, you're just annoying. Okay. How do you... How do you see if something is a mimic in this game? I should actually check that. Is it... Is it those hinges on the back? Because they look a little bit different. There must be a way to see it. But... God, motherfucking damn it. It's a great design. Like, it's a really nice, appropriately horrifying design for the thing. If I remember right, in Dark Souls 1, the teeth were all fingers. To sort of denote its connection with, uh, with greed. Alright, let's go collect. For the trauma. Oh, fuck off! Yeah. How hard could it possibly be to jump into a well? Okay. Of course, now I'm curious about all the other wells in the game. Can I jump into all of them? Should I? Probably not. Oh, yeah. <sighs> At least I'm getting a workout. Finally! All I wanted was to throw myself down a well. Staff of Wisdom and Dark Leggings. Well, that sounds like a weapon I can't really use for anything. Staff of the Lost Land of Olefis. Sorcery dedicated catalyst cannot be used to cast hexes. The crystal at the tip of the staff greatly augments spell strength. Already a finely crafted staff made even more effective by its crystal, the brilliance of which has been polished over time with powerful magic. Cool. Leggings of a night subsumed by dark. No one knows the true identity of these men who are said to freely manipulate dark. Old foreign legends describe them as poor souls who chased the lost art of life drain. Oh, I think we know who that is. Yeah, it's the it's the uh, the dark wraiths, presumably. At least that's what it looks like. Okay, is there anything else here at Seldora? No, it's just. Traps and cathedrals and.
Do -do 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 -do. Uh. Okay. Well, now I can't put it off anymore, can I? Well, yes, I can. I can still put it off. I'm still gonna put off the gutter. Fuck the gutter. I'm not going to the gutter. I don't like it. I'm procrastinating! Because if I remember right, there's a petrified guy down here, and I can't remember what he's what he's petrified in front of, if it's anything useful or interesting. So I just want to check it out. Ah, it was that way. Duh. Hmm, it's not like there's any point of jumping off the elevator before you're supposed to, is there? No. It doesn't look that way. It all looks very solid. Also, you can't. I see. Yeah, there aren't any doors or openings in the walls or anything. No. Nope. I wonder if... Is there anything below the elevator? Not like I can make it go back up, so... No way to know. Right, so there's... Enemies lying in the water, I remember. Not very dangerous to me at this stage, I'm sure, but... Yeah. <laughs> Still... Yeah, because it was this guy here. Yeah, yeah. Oh, hello. That's an elephant man. If I'm any judge. What the hell is an elephant man doing here? Fun fact, if you aggro one of the pigs in Soldora and guide it all the way down to the spider boss building, it will drop a pickaxe. Very hard slash useless. Okay, I, th I don't think I mind having that, sp that, uh, <laughs> that secret spoiled for me. <laughs> I think that's all right. Okay. Again, I guess I have to trust that there will be more branches. Because there's an elephant man up there, and I want to know why. Sure it would be nice if it led to a new boss also. And he is an enemy. Ah! And he tracks just as... He has just as bullshit tracking as his friends in the...
chest ahead, huh? Mastodon armor. Try tongue. Yeah, yeah, I get it. Hey, yes, this flask shard. Okay, that was worth it, at least. That was worth it, at least. No, I wanted to read the message! In case there was a trap. Jesus. Oh, knight helm and armor. Is that the classic? Hey, it's the good old, old classic Dark Souls look. Oh, I feel all nostalgic. <laughs> and I even still have a non-shitty roll. Well, I mean, it's not great, but... Aw, look at me, looking like a Dark Souls 1 level 1 knight. Aw, or level 5, is that what they start at? Those doors are broken? Oh, bit of a letdown. Hmm. Okay, I guess that's all that was here. Now I want more branches! And there wasn't anything else in here, was there? Like, later on down the line? No, we just get into the cove. Right, okay. <sighs> Here's a question actually. What happened to the to the priestess lady who was here before? Like, I found her here, and then she was all like, I must preach to the stupid fools who I'm gonna fleece for all their money, or whatever. But then I couldn't find her in Majula anymore. Well, I couldn't find her anywhere, really. And I have no idea where she's gone. I guess she's somewhere? On the other hand, I kind of don't care. <laughs> oh, but, oh, but we should look at, uh... We should talk to the blacksmith. Maybe he has some new stuff. You need armor? Uh, no, not apparently. The Alva set is actually kind of good. Are you sure? I'm not going to change the helm, because I like the helm, and I'm not going to change the high denied armor. That's 30 defense for 1.8 pounds, and that's 39 for 2.8. Okay. Oh, no, wait, the gloves are actually terrible. And the boots are passably good. Hmm. <laughs> But no new boss armor or anything. Oh well. Are you sure? Looking for Is the thing that he only gets new stock when you buy from him? Is that it? Like, do you have to spend in order for because I feel like he should have more stuff. Like if he's the boss armor guy, it's weird that I've only got the lost sinner.
Mm-hmm. Let me see. Uh... Okay, I'll buy the Falconer armor set. Thanks for the purchase. See if that does anything. Okay, item box. Let's just get rid of that. Stuff that I'll never use. The gear armor, for example. Seldora robe. Robe worn by settlers of Seldora. The bright stone that brought prosperity to Seldora served only to stoke the flames of its people's desires, eventually leading to its ruin. Those bewitching, brilliantly gleaming stones are said to be fragments of a being that once roamed the entrails of the earth. Effect increases the number of souls acquired. That's not actually terrible. Try walking to Med from Medulla to Hydus Tower to procrastinate. Why? Is there a reason to? I mean, okay. I actually haven't, uh... There is that, there is that, uh, there's that, there's that, uh, um, um, thing. There's a thing. Down here, there's a thing. Only has humanoid armor sets, also got to go but Tark. Oh, hey, hello. Oh, hello there. So and that's where she see. fucking is. This room is not as it seems. There are two, not one, pathways leading out. And only this lovely thing reveals the other path. And this, you lovely thing, only runs on miracles. Shall I provide you with one? Oh, interesting. To cast miracles, you must have strong faith in the gods. Miracles began as tales told by gods. We preserve their will with law, pray to their greatness, and are blessed in return. You must nourish your faith. Miracles have been passed down through us since the first flame. Isn't it extraordinary to think they've existed since the very origins of the world? And now, you can have this power for yourself. She's advertising. Out on ha! To Only 299 souls and 24 easy installments. What is the first flame? Well, it's... <laughs> You're not ready to comprehend it, I'm afraid. She doesn't know, yeah. You because no one knows. More faith and more miracles. Many more miracles. <laughs> to cast miracles, you must. And indeed. Oh, okay, there's a homeward bone, but it's a miracle. Nice. Yeah, move the path, please. Ooh. Ooh. Go ahead. Thank you. Oh, don't... Rouge water. Try message. Hurrah for mess. It's another message chain. <laughs> <laughs> I like these. These are fun. They're cute. So where does this lead? Into an infinite abyssal void that I don't want to fall into. Okay. I don't like this. Oh, this path is very small. Oh, thank God. There's gonna be a boulder rolling down at my face in just a second, isn't there? <laughs> Weakness leg? 
hex is required ahead. Hello? I don't know who you are, but believe me, B, the frailty of the weak disrupts the dark. The dark, huh? So I've seen it. We've seen another character in this game who talks about the dark and sits in a chair. Me alone. I'm interested in one thing, dark. You haven't the gift. Leave me. I'm interested. Okay. So I guess what they mean by hexes required is that you have to. You have to have learned hexes or be able to use them before he'll give a shit about you. Okay. Oh, Huntsman's Cops. New area. Nice. And I can procrastinate on going to the gutter. Gorgeous view ahead. Oh, I'll say holy shit. Holy shit, that's pretty. Look at that. Look at all those layers. Like, all those layers of, of like, those are just, like, okay. So, that right there, all of these are just, like, layers of flat 2D images that are kind of vaguely animated, swaying a bit. But in combination all together, because they're layered over top of each other with mists in between them, it looks magnificently deep and contrasts really well with the skybox. That's really fucking cool. Nice. <laughs> Message ahead. Try shield. Shield. Well, that was loud. Okay, I think I've heard it. I've heard what I needed to hear. Back to the stone ring. Am I gonna need a torch in here? Whoa! Oh, it's you. Fuck off and die. Okay, I need to go and buy, uh, bolts. I need to go and buy bolts. Or arrows, or maybe upgrade my bow, actually. Maybe that's the thing I should do. <laughs> I knew you. Okay, let's start by buying all of your Titanite shards. The Dragon Rider bow actually seems really good. Albeit... Because that's it, that, like, that gets more bonus from my strength stat. But I'm not sure if I want to put the points in Dexterity to get that up there, so... There. Short bow's a bit better now. be around.
Oh wait, someone sent someone sent me a super chat that said to talk to Tark. Which bit of a spoiler there, I think, but alright. Might as well do it. Oh yeah, I've killed that ghost so many times he's not here anymore. But the Lion Man is, though. Yeah, he's there. And he's acroed. He's an acro, little man. Okay. Fire sword doesn't do a lot of damage to him. Bring some curse resistance to do this shit. Because, ah! Fine. I'll just accept it. Who cares? Doesn't matter. What's up, dude? What skill? You've defeated my master. Your master? But our master never dies. And he changes form so that he may seethe for all eternity. Okay, all right, all Brave right. Human, you have yet to face your greatest perils. Take these. May joy await you at the end of your travels. Okay, all right, seethe. <laughs> he literally said seethe. It's a pun. <laughs> I have defeated his master, huh? Wait, who the fuck would his master be then? It wouldn't be the Magus. Surely. Because the... Seethe. There's so many puns in Japanese storytelling. Like, they do it all the fucking time. Someone who, like, changes forms and take... And the Duke... Oh, the game is taunting me with this. It's taunting me with it. Because we have the compelling argument that, no, no, the Duke is Lord Seldora. And the Brightstone Spider was, like, the, the, the dragon down there was just a... Uh, but then this... You literally said seethe! I mean... A thing that changes shapes through the ages so that it may see th for Oh! <laughs> I have no cup, but st Anyway, he gave me a ring. He even gave me a dragon ring. Of all things, a dragon ring. Oh. Increases HP, stamina, and maximum equipment load. A dragon signet ring. Grants its bearer the protection of dragons. Increases HP, stamina, and maximum load, but is easily broken. Oh, right. Oh yeah, it doesn't have much durability, does it? Rolmun, king of Drain Lake, served the king by guarding the fort until his own demise and was said to have cherished this ring throughout his life of service. Because the game is being coy about it. Like, it's not outright saying, oh yeah, Seath the Scale is the survivor of the first days, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> this is taunting. Like, this is cruel, Dark Souls 2. <laughs> this is cruel. <sighs> right, okay. That's something to consider. I killed his, th that guy's master. And that must have been when I killed the spider. Because it can't have been the fucking Magus, can it? 
Because that seemed more like a mini-boss than an actual full-fledged... And it can't have been the Royal Rat Authority either. Like, that wouldn't make any sense. Or the Royal Rat Vanguard. Or the Belfry Gargoyles. It could be Ornstein, I guess, but... Well, the Old Dragon Slayer, rather. But that wouldn't make a lot of sense either. Because I haven't talked to Tark in ages. Oh, Dark Souls 2, you taunt me. You taunt me! You make a mockery of me! Alright. Huntsman's Cops, then. was a second one. Yeah, there he is. And then there's that little bastard. Who drops items like an like a dickhead. Hello. Sorry for being rude. That wasn't acceptable on my part. Hope that you have fun and my impatience didn't impact you too much. Thanks for playing this. I mean, if you hadn't said anything, I don't think I would have ever, ever gone back to talk to Tark, probably. So, no harm, no foul, I guess. But, yeah. Well, I would have, it, like, eventually, I, like, by the end of the game, by the time when I felt like I couldn't find, can't find any more secrets, that's when I'll probably start asking directly. Like, is the, like, give me small hints about where to go kind of thing. So that's stuff on the wall there. Tree roots, I guess, it's supposed to be? Well, since I'm here, might as well shoot that thing too. If I can. Feel like maybe I can't. Yes, I can. Be rid of that. Be wary of hole or hurrah for hole. Is this another sex joke? Oh. Oh, that looks like an entrance to something. Okay, is there any enemies here I need to... <laughs> Hi! <laughs> hole and then hole. Wait, it can't be that, can it? Breath of the Wild puzzle? No, okay. Well... Hmm. We're off for fatty, then try- Yeah, yeah, yeah. Jesus, Dark Souls 2 fans. Honestly. Perverts the lot of you. Try bravery. Okay, so it's just ambush city up in here. Ah, poison arrows. Great. This is like being back in the Undead Burg. Yeah, oh, fuck off. And I can't target him either. Oh, well, shit, I fell down. Never mind targeting then.
Wow, you guys are not worth the trouble in terms of souls. Yeah, bandit's knife, just like the start of Dark Souls 1, basically. No, doesn't do nothing. Well, shouldn't fall into the hole that much, just for sure. No? That seems like an obvious door, though. What a thrill With darkness and silence through the night Alright. Oh, come the hell on! How do you miss that, my friend? My character, my dude. That's a bit of a fortress, isn't it? How do I get to that bridge? He has a whip. Cool. Oh, you're a big boy. And that whip has dark power. Please don't do that to me. Do we need to jump down here? Oh, there's an item, so... What a fear in my heart That you're so supreme I'd give my life Not for honor But for you Guess the bridge is through there. Now, ring of blades back on, please. Oh, I guess it's not. Oh, I guess it is. Ah, fuck you! Jerk. Quagmire. Is that a Family Guy reference? Gorgeous view ahead. Also looks like there's a moth somewhere spreading poison. Ah, he's pre-programmed to attack immediately, I see. <laughs> Another dude hanging on a bridge. Making an easy target of himself. <laughs> okay, so I could jump over there and grab the item, but I'm not sure I'd be able to get back down or back out safely again. I did see a poison cloud, though. So where's the moth hiding? Ooh, bonfire! Nice. Nice, again. Excellent. I'm sure I saw a poison cloud being released here, though. 
I don't want to get blindsided by it. There's gonna be some... This guy up there. So the guy up there is probably going to come and jump down. If not... I'll make him. Is that another whip guy? Nope. What the hell is that weapon? Ow! Okay. Dick is up with that. Okay, I can't stagger him at all. But he staggers the fuck out of me. What the hell was that weapon? That was annoying. Figured. Small orange burr. Oh! Boosts fire defense. That's nice. Not like there's any new items that I haven't read the description of, right? Oh shit, that's a player. That's a player for damn sure, hi. And there's lag going on too. Yeah, I'm not going inside that. Whoa, how the fuck did that hit me? Uh, threw me off a cliff. Fair enough. That's fair enough. There's so much fucking lag. Every time I'm invaded, it seems like I get hit by things because of lag. It's frankly a bit distressing. That's a better way to deal with him. Well, I got an extra torch. That's something. hearing. The hell? That was something close. Oh, there you are. 
planning a little ambush, were we? I see. <laughs> I see. Sorry to spoil the party. Oh, good. Yeah, I'm just gonna cheese you a little bit there. Just did not want to deal with that. Oh. There we go. I knew I saw a poison cloud. And there's a moth hanging out right there. Must be a way in there. Hopefully also a way out. Should have known. Should have known. And there's a forlorn. Okay. Great. Come on, swing at me. Come on. Okay, that's his blocking stance, I see. And that R2 is way too slow. I should stop using it. <clears throat> or L2, rather. Piss off. Ghost. Secret ahead. Yeah, ah ha ha ha. Dash attack. No. Aromatic ooze. And a little life gem. Isn't that nice? A little life gem. <sighs> Alright. Aha. Okay. Slowly clearing out the place, I think. More poison moths. Well, not the worst thing. With all these fucking moths around. Okay, this feels a lot like a trap. Like, oh look, there's a shiny item inside this place. Morning star and a large soul of a nameless soldier. Alright. Guess it wasn't entirely a trap. <laughs> Pointless. Okay.
What's that guy running away from? Let's move carefully here. Eliminating one at a time required a head. Well, we can start with this guy. So what I'm suspecting is that I'll pull that lever and some kind of horde will attack me. It certainly seems to have announced my position. Probably if I pulled the lever before eliminating all the enemies around here, they would have rushed me. I figure. Ah, I see. I can jump down in there, but there's a tough enemy. Hmm. Oh, yes. If that's a mimic, I'll be pissed. Yeah, that doesn't do nothing. Damn it, I had him. I had him for a backstab. There we go. Not that tough. Soul Spear. Green Blossom. Poison Moss. Okay. Not a mimic. <laughs> Not trapped. Sublime Bone Dust. Nice! More Estus upgrade. More Estus upgrade is good. Okay. Making good progress here. The enemies are like not too tough. There's that running away guy again. And one more. Okay, where are they going? Again with the goofy walks like they're just fleeing, I guess. <laughs> okay. I don't care then. Goodbye. Okay. What's gonna kill me on the bridge? Try dash, you say. Alright. Hmm. Nothing's gonna kill me on the bridge, apparently. Ah, an open cage. A man cage. And quite a lot of burning bodies. And a bonfire. In a room. That's locked. Ah! Oh, that's bullshit. That's bullshit! Open it up! More laughter jars. I don't know what that is, but I don't like it. Oh, it's a skeleton. Okay. I can handle skeletons. Unless they get up again. These are regenerating skeletons. It didn't die. There's a necromancer here. Yep.
There he is. Oh no! Oh! I didn't see there was a hole. Oh! I th I thought it was just flat ground. Oh! Oh, that stings a bit. That does sting. Thanks for the Fs in chat. They are sorely needed right now. <laughs> How the hell do you change ammo? Is that R2? Nope. That one sucked. That one sucked real bad. Well, at least now I know where the necromancer is. And I know that there is a necromancer. Do they aggro across the bridge? Well, he does. But I don't think his dog does. Nope. It ignores me. Or what? Does it? Nope. It's also after me. Okay. Just took it a while. Vengeance. Also, reclaiming my souls. So let's just start with that. You gonna open the door for me? No? How do we do that then? I can't really see anything in here. Is there like a switch on the wall somewhere? Or 
remember there was a torch back here too. If I had had a torch before, I wouldn't have rolled into the pit. I would have seen it. Yeah, there's definitely a switch right there. Okay, so I have- that's a shortcut that you come through on the other end, I guess. Unless you want to open it for me? Guess not. Did the skeleton react to the torch? Is it like is it like with the spiders? The skeleton's afraid of torches? No, okay. All right. But I feel like it's reacting to it, like it... I guess not. Okay, I'm just imagining things. Two can play at that game. Where the hell's the moth that did that? There. Outside of the range? Nope. Be wary of left. I see it. <laughs> Don't give up, skeleton! Hey, flame butterflies, nice. Just get rid of that guy, too. <laughs> Tongue butthole. Ugh, oh, fuck's sake. Can you think of nothing else? I gotta say, it's it's nice that all the Dark Souls fans are so progressive about eating ass. Like, I'm glad to see that they are not threatened in their heterosexuality. Or homosexuality, for that matter. By the prospect. There isn't, like, anything else that I forgot back here, is there? Because I was so focused after getting shot at. Oh, there is. There's this. And that. And... Where the hell did that guy go?
Oh, I see. So that leads back here. Right, so both paths lead to the same place, basically. Except, of course, they don't, because... Here I was going, like, a roundabout way. But it's connected. Okay, that's good to know. Hmm, what's up here? Oh, for fuck's sake, again? Okay, that's an NPC. Yep, definitely an NPC. With a really cool hat. Oh, okay. And a single-use Estus Flask. By... Undead Lockaway Key. Oh, is that the one for the bonfire? Oh, I hope so. Oh, I see. Oh, I see. I see. Okay. Right. So, this is a risk or reward thing. You do that even a little bit wrong, you're fucked. Not worth it. I don't care what those items are, not worth it. I have 21,000 souls. Oh, good. This time it's a player, though. <sighs> I'll just wait for them here. On the assumption that they can find me. There he is. And he has a spell ready for me, too. And I don't seem to be able to do a fuck of damage to him at all. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, yeah, fuck you too, guy. Seriously considering turning off online play. <laughs> Seriously considering turning it off. Because, uh. Is that guy gonna come down? Looks like it. Yeah, there he is. No. Does that guy not come down normally? Or does he wait around and ambush you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Poison Cloud. I don't care. You're not worth the arrows anymore.
Okay. So I can go over the bridge and get back to where I was and get my fucking souls. Okay, so I think once we activate the bonfire that I hope we have gotten the key for, that'll be the end of the stream for the night. Wait, hang on. This is not where my souls are. Oh, mother fuck me sideways. Why are those weapons black? Like, why do they glow black or glow black? You can't glow black, but get what I mean. <sighs> Fuck you. Just hit the thing I'm targeting, you dickhead. Fucking hell. Well, that sucked. Yeah, you can die too. This is going to turn out to be exactly the wrong fucking direction. Well, my soul's back, though. Oh, this is not the right direction at all. At least that skeleton dies. This is a completely different direction. Fuck me! I am bad at navigation. This is I want to get my souls and get the bonfire and end. That's all I want. Have mercy on me. Do I really have to go through the skeleton cave for this? Okay, activate the bonfire first. Oh, there's an NPC here. I think. Get my Estus back. Who are you? I thought you'd have bastard for a moment. You've set me free. Now I can find him. The find who? Prick. He won't know what hit him. I am Kraton of Mira. 
I travel from land to land to hone my blade. I've heard this land was full of danger. I thought it would suit me perfectly. I joined forces with a man on the way. He was oh, I think I know which man he's talking about. Knife. He took the first chance he had to try and off me. I decided to set a trap for him here. But then I got trapped myself. I can't believe that I was so dense. Thank the stars that you came along. You be careful of him. Yeah, Pete. Uh, patches of this game. He wears this rather unusual ring. You know it when you see it. I've seen this type before. He kills entirely for the pleasure of it. I'm sure I won't be his last victim. The man's better off dead. I tell ya, he's a slick talker. So don't let him fool ya. Pate, the man with a strange ring. Watch out for the slimy rat. And don't you believe a word that he says. I'll find a common for bad and put an end to his roguery. <laughs> Fist pump. Pate. Well, I guess my suspicions about Pate were confirmed there. Not that that's any great feat. Okay, here, over here, here's where my souls are. Nothing else up here, right? Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> okay. Whew. Right. I am a little exhausted, I must admit. It's been a long stream, and I'm calling it to a close here. So we got a whole bunch of exploring done here by the end of it, but we didn't find any new bosses whatsoever. But we found a few ways, hopefully, to get to... some new bosses. I hope so. And that's gonna have to happen on the next stream, and the next stream will happen after... Um, I have finished editing the current crop of footage into some, into some episodes. I think I've got three, two or three episodes. Uh, at least, in the footage that we've got so far. And then the footage, I think most of the exploration stuff that we've got here is either going to be an extra episode, or I'm going to fold it into some later episode. So, thank you very much for tuning in. I hope you have all enjoyed it. Please consider supporting me on, you know, Patreon, or sending me a tip on coffee if you want to. Uh, or if you're not inclined to support me, consider supporting content creators in general, because that one dollar makes much more of a difference than you think it does. And yeah, just thank you very much for tuning in. Thanks for hanging out with me. Thanks for making fun of me in chat. I can't look at chat very much when I stream this stuff, because you guys do post some spoilers. But whenever I am looking at it, it's usually when I figure that you guys are making fun of me failing or something, and it's it's actually a joy. So I'm very, very pleased uh, that people enjoy watching me capture footage for this stuff. So, thank you very much for watching, and I hope you have a wonderful night.